Thank you, Detective. More details are expected today after skeletal remains were found inside a home in Seguin. The discovery was made after officers received a tip. Now, so far, no arrests have been made in connection with the case. Our Alicia Barrera is live with that story. So, Alicia, what can you tell us about this case? Well, a woman and her teen daughter actually live in that home where those remains were found. That's in the 900 block of Anderson Street. And the woman actually showing up after police uh, were there and letting them go inside the home and do that initial search. And police say both the woman and that teen daughter have been cooperative during this investigation. Now, this all happened on Sunday. Investigators do believe the bones found are of an adult. But who that individual is, how they died, and why the remains were in that home are details that remain unknown. Texas State University's Department of Anthropology, Texas Rangers, and Guadalupe County's DA's office are working together in finding those answers. The Anthropology Department stated it has been a time-consuming process due to the bones being there for quite some time and scattered in a room. The goal is to analyze the remains and look for trauma or anything that could indicate the manner or cause of death. Now, that analysis originally was said to take about a week or two. Again, this morning, we're waiting to find more answers. We could learn more details on how that person died, who that person is. That press conference with the Seguin Department, Seguin Police Department, expected to start around 10 this morning. Back to you.